Hello friends, I'm Pastor Eunsu. I'm so excited to share this time with you. So I have a question. Do you like to eat? Oh, I like to eat. I'm a foodie. What is your favorite food? My favorite foods are pizza, hamburger, or oh yeah, bojangle chicken. I love it. Well, what if every morning you could open the door and walk out into the yard and just pick up your favorite food? And of course, you can all of that. That will be great, right? So today we're going to talk about a story from the Bible and it is like um, what we have just talked. It is about God's people, the Israelites. So they were stuck as prisoners in Egypt for a long time. And when they finally got free and left Egypt, they were trying to find the special land that God said they would have. But then they got lost in the desert for a while. After a few months of wandering around, the people started to grumble and complain against God. They said, God, we are so starving. We had better when we were in Egypt. At least we had a, a plenty of food there. But now we are almost dying. God heard the people complaining. So God told Moses, who was their leader, that in the evening, God would provide quail, which is the meat. And in the morning, God would provide something special called manna, which is like a bread. And that would be on the ground for everyone to eat. So the people had to do was just go outside and pick it up and eat. It is so cool, right? Why did God do this for those grumblers and complainers? God did it so that they would know God loved them and God would take care of them. God had not brought them out of Egypt so that they just feel starving or hungry in the desert. Sometimes we grumble and we complain. We forget that God loves us and God provides us um, with everything that we need. So this week, instead of grumbling and complaining, let us say, thank you, God. Let us do that right now through our prayers. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for giving us what we need. Sometimes we grumble and complain. When we do, help us remember that every good thing we have comes from you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.